Good morning, guys. It's 6.30. Let's start our day. I've gotten a lot of questions in the past couple of months. I want to try and answer them today. We have a really busy day ahead of us. Uh, I hope you're ready for it. Follow me. All right, guys. So first stop is at the office. It is early. You know what? Maybe we should go get a coffee first. What's your favorite kind of coffee? I like a dark roast Tim Hortons coffee. That's, my, that's me. All right, black. Thank you. Bye-bye. Here, guys. Jonathan, take your small coffee, man. We're going to Beaconsfield today, actually. We've got a couple of things to do there. I have a property, actually, that is in the process of being uh, built, like rebuilt. He just stripped the whole thing. And I want to see what he's done so far, so it's going to be interesting enough. It's, uh, I've got no insurance, guys, so wear your hard hats, which I don't have. <laughs> just saying, all right? Verbal agreements are binding in the province of Quebec. Yeah, the other door might not be open. Okay. All right, you want go. me to go open it? Yeah, yeah. I'll go with this person because th that's going to open soon. So. Go, Jenny, go. Do it. Do it. <laughs> Is he okay? <laughs> What's that? Tell me you got that on camera. <laughs> All right. You guys good? Yeah, I'm just going through the certificate of location for one of the properties I'm going to be listing. So I just want to make sure that it's not older than what it needs to be because they told me they got a new one and it seems okay. So take it from there. I got to scan all this stuff as well. So this is the part of the day that really isn't all that fun. But it has to be done, you know, so I do it. I come early in the morning. I try to get it out of the way before the rest of my day, which is basically meeting other clients, doing any shoots we need to do. A lot of this job is basically uh, dealing with associates. That's, that's the business model I've worked with. Anyways, there's many ways of, of handling your business. People do cold calls, do door knocking, right? Everyone has their own way of doing things. I enjoy the one-on-one -on -one relationship aspect of this business. Meeting people, going out, going for happy hour, you know, doing all, all those things, then your job becomes fun. You're gonna kinda get an idea today of how my day goes about and I'll try and answer questions in between. Snow, snow, that's what we want. We're off to uh, a, new, a new condo development, actually new, relatively new, a couple of years. Uh, in Pierrefond actually, close to the water. And it's a beautiful condo we just listed. And it's actually really unique in, in uh, West Island. People always ask, like, oh, can we get these large, really like modern condos in, in the West Island? Yeah, they exist, right? We're gonna go see one now. All right, let's go. So here we are in the elevator. It's really exciting. Moving up in the world. Yeah, we are moving up in the world. That's good. That's good. Danny, how's it going, buddy? You doing good? All is well? Good, good. I brought my boys. So people think that West Island is all about like just homes, residential, single family homes. We have condos in the West Island, obviously. We have condos that are waterfront, you know, which is high in demand. I get that a lot more actually than City Skyline. People say, I want waterfront, waterfront, waterfront. Obviously, the, the, uh, the price tag that comes with it isn't always uh, you know, so glamorous. But here in the West Island, you're able to still get waterfront at $5.99. And we have like spectacular views. Obviously, it's all snowed in right now. Uh, but you have three bedrooms, 1350 square feet, two bathrooms. It's an awesome place. And uh, we're listing it tonight, so uh, stay tuned. Properties is a really funny thing, you know, you try to get this one house and it's like your dream house and You're like, oh, I love everything about it. You don't get it. You're like devastated and uh, You're like, oh man, I'm never gonna find this thing again and lo and behold You know a couple of weeks later you find something even better, right? So I, I always tell people I'm like don't get discouraged because we don't get one property There isn't only one property out there for you <laughs> we don't need don't another falling again. Man. We don't need another one of those clips. <laughs> Very nice. 
makes such a big difference, right? Because you have like the white and the black versus the, the steel, right? It wasn't that it was bad, it just said this is a lot more. Yesterday somebody called me from Remax. Yeah. He said, who are you going with? I said, Mr. Puri, I'm sorry. I said, you know what? I have nothing to explain to you. Yeah. If you have a buyer, bring it. Puriya is going to take care of it. You know, uh, we're off market, but we're still like, That's we're still it. active. They don't, I said, I, it's that I moved out. Yeah. I'm doing some renovation and he's going to continue. Uh, well, first of all, they shouldn't be calling you because you're technically still under contract. Oh, nice. We had like comfortable carpet here. Now we have our hardwood floors, so it's nice. Really what, what we did here, we did subtle changes, right? To kind of magnify the, the assets of the property. But anyways, I don't want to bore you with details because there are a lot of little things, but, uh, but it's very nice. I'm very happy with the results. So we're done with the lights here? Or? We are done. Yeah, no, it's really good. Thank you for, for doing this. It's to sell the house. I know, but not everyone listens. So thank you. You know what's really cool about this property? You've got about 16,000 square feet of land, right? So in the back, there, there are many things you can do, but it goes all the way to the front, actually. You see those like trees? Uh, you see that little pool there, right? It keeps going like after the garage. So you can actually add a pool there. You could have like a whole area and you could fence it in. And then you'd be, you know, in this awesome little location there. So off to the next, downtown. Downtown Montreal. Are we going to uh, the construction? Oh, yeah. Good call. You see, that's why I have you here, Brandon. <laughs> what are we doing for you? We're going to our construction site now, which is a little bit higher up in Beaconsfield. So this is Beaconsfield Southwest, which is arguably the most expensive area per square foot in, uh, in the West Island. And now we're going to go a little bit more central, which is also a really cool cool place let's go check it out what's going on man where are you doing i have five minutes to talk because i thought i'd call you to say hello sir and uh, you're, well thank uh, you for kidding. that yeah. man that's that's I'll really nice of you. he's not being himself so usually we have a bit of um, a different tonality on this conversation <laughs> this guy he's actually one of my closest friends from like high school and um he's all, also uh an incredible chef so he's he's an international chef and he does some of our events, so uh, you guys should give him a call. He does sushi as his specialty, so omakase. Shout out to him. So dude. Uh, you world class act, that's yeah. what you are. <laughs> <laughs> a scholar and a gentleman. A scholar and a gentleman, man, that's me. Hey everybody, I hope you enjoyed part one of our day. We've got three more parts coming. To see some more, please hit subscribe, follow me on Facebook, follow me on Instagram, and I'll see you all next week.